Hey guys, it's Friday, right? And today we're gonna to continue that topic of flexibility even through the demonstration that we're gonna do here. Now, we're gonna go into um, what, how we deal with overactive tissue and what we call inhibiting it through myofascial release. Now, we're gonna do the self form, which is basically commonly known as foam rolling. And you know that like you go to the massage therapist and then they work on the tissue and it softens it up. How does all this work? It's real simple. There's these little sensors at the end of a muscle that are in the tendon that when pressure is put directly on the muscle, it causes that overactive tissue to even get tighter. And in doing so, it's telling that, oh my God, this is way too much. I gotta let this tissue soften up. So what happens is the tissue starts to release. And as it does that, you do, the more and more you do this, the more that tissue stays in a, a permanent state of released or in normal flexibility range. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a foam roller and I'm just gonna demonstrate on the calf how you, you do a little bit of foam rolling and this works on that issue where your feet might turn out or flat and your knees bail gets in a little bit like we demonstrated earlier where you can't reach your toes. So this is gonna help that. But obviously, if you think you have any of these major kind of things, you really need to get on a program of strong foam rolling, flexibility work, and strengthening underactive tissue daily. Okay, so let me show you how to use the foam roller to do this. What we're gonna do is I'm just gonna have you sit down on the roller with your calf. Um, so we got these two muscles. We got the long skinny one and the big one looks like a pear on the back of the leg. So let's start off with a pear, up a little higher. And then what I want you to do is I want you to put your other leg crossing over it. And then you're gonna move around until you find a spot that hurts because that is the tight tissue, that is the hot spot. And then you sit there on that spot and you do a little bit of a side jiggle, side to side, not up and down, side to side, pushing on that spot, trying to get it to release. This is gonna take 30 seconds to a minute. And then once that does, you move up and you find the next spot. And right there is one for me. And I sit there and I hold that and I wiggle back and forth a little bit. Now, this form of um, stretching, as we, or what we call autogenic inhibition, which is designed to help lengthen out um, overactive tissue. Now we wanna do that on a regular basis so that we can start to let the tissue that's underactive as we're strengthening it come back into alignment. And the two work together synergistically to make it so movement patterns are correct. Listen, flexibility, huge. Um, many different strategies to fix it, to make it so that the aches and pains disappear. So you really need to fi try to figure out what might be going on. Why do you have these aches and pains? Talk to a professional, physical therapist, somebody like me, that can help you design a program to help it so that you can get through life comfortably, not have to go out in the backyard and come back in and be like, oh my God, I'm dying. Shouldn't be that way. Muscle tissue should work with you, not against you. All right, listen guys, it's Friday. Have a great weekend. I'll talk to you next week.